Hello and welcome back to another tutorial by myself, Syndicate, uh, of the Pandora Gaming Network. Uh, this one is to do with a character creation system, so let's have a quick look at what we'll be learning today. So as you can see, the first thing it does is it asks you your gender, then it'll ask you for a class. So we've got three different classes we can choose from for the female. We've got two different hair colors. As you can see, it will then build your character and show you what you look like. From there, you've got a name chooser, so you can input your own name. Now this part, you will be able to start all over again if you wanted to, or you can, can continue if you're happy with this character and the name you've chosen. So we could start again and try again. Now you can have male, female. I've put a little jokey one here for alien. So if you were to choose that, you can choose the alien. You can see here that the text shows up is different for each different gender, um, male, female. <laughs> And alien, it says, what a gross looking alien, as opposed to a pretty female. Now you can choose two different classes for the alien. So I'm going to go soul sucker. Here we are, I feel the power flowing through you. So again, you can input your name. I'm just gonna be called alien just for speed. And we can continue this time. Now what I've also done is each class actually has a different starting area. So the alien starts in the alien home world. Okay. Now there's another bit tutorial here um, to do with the profiles. So for example, you can see that the profile for this alien soul sucker is give me your souls. Whereas if we talk to this frog over here, profile frog, bet you were wondering, what about my character profile? Well, you can change that too with questions. I'm only doing the aliens for this tutorial. Same technique applies. Conditional branches. Destroy all humans. Just the ones who don't purchase RPG Maker. And then if we go into here, my profile is now morally correct. Whereas if we can talk to the frog again, I changed what I say first with a self switch. This is, a, this is useful if you don't want me looping. A loopy frog. Eh, eh. So, take the profile test again. Yes. Destroy all humans. Yes. And this time you can now see that I'm a hater of muggles. So that's another uh, tutorial that's included in the demo, which I will provide you with. Uh, so all of this you can learn uh, by downloading the demo. Uh, however, I'll quickly go through a few things you need to do to, to set this up yourself as well. So the first thing I did, I went into the database and I actually created my actors, my classes, and a big important thing is that you actually use this character generator to generate all your different characters and classes. So as you can see from the database here, I have quite a few. So we've got the male Lancer with brown hair, male Lancer with blue hair, female with blonde, female with red, ninja green, ninja black, ninja purple, ninja pink, etc, etc. Um, so we've got all of them built up. So once you build your database, you build your classes. Uh, so you start off with the naked, then you've got Lancer, Warlock, Ninja, Brain Licker, Soul Sucker. Obviously, you can change the traits and their skills, uh, determining you know to determine their class a bit better. For example, Ninjas would have you know quick slash attacks and so on. Warlocks would have you know summon minions and so on and so forth. So I'll let you guys think about that. That's uh, you know that's your game. Uh, so you you think about that in more detail. Uh, this is just to, to obviously learn the foundations on how to do this. So after you've done all of that, the only thing you need to do now is edit your kind of first page. So I've done a creation event page. So when you first start the game, it'll come here. You can see that my starting character is nothing. Now the way I did that, I went into system and you can change the starting party. So I've just got start in my starting party. And if you go to start, you'll see he's got nothing. So he just shows up as blank. The background here, if you go into edit, is just a parallax background, starlit sky, and it's looping vertically five. So that's that one there. 
Now, in this event, it's really complicated, so I do apologize if you're new to RPG Maker. Uh, I do recommend you learn a little about conditional branches and switches beforehand, just so you learn the basics of the game. This part here is a label to jump back to the start. That's how we reset. Um, when After we choose our name, we can reset if, if we want to, to start again. So that's why it removes everything, because it restarts the whole script again. The script essentially starts from here. So it says, welcome, are you male or female? You then choose male, female, and then I added the third choice. Oh my god, I'm an alien. So you've got that there. Next part to do is the conditional branch for the genders. So for example, if you chose male, there are certain conditions that only will be met if you're the male. So, excellent, what a big strong man, for example. And then males have different hair colours for their classes. Um, and then you go on to the next one. So female, excellent, what a pretty lady. They've got different color hair for their classes. Again, you can do anything. You don't need to do hair color. You can do, you know, have you got wings? Have you got long ears? Have you got blue eyes? Again, this is just the foundations. You can customize it to your game. Um, then we've got warlock again, different hair colors, different, um, bits and bobs for them aliens again they've got their own kind of unique branch i just want to show you something separate from the the three separate classes so we've got an alien with the classes brain liquor and soul sucker so that's a bit different um so once you've gotten through that the next part you go on to is the name change branch so i had to do this it was quite a long-winded way to do it, but it works. Um, so if you chose the male Lancer with brown hair, then name input processing will change for the male Lancer with brown hair. Uh, it basically allocates the correct actor uh, to the correct name change. So if you just put name input processing and then chose the default one. So for example, if we went to name input processing and then we just went, okay, that's going to try and change the name of actor start and actor star isn't actually in our party so it won't work so that's how that works and it does it for every single one after that it goes interesting you wouldn't joke around with me and this is the reset back up to the start so as you can see if you're happy with your choices it says good to hear and it will jump onto the next part if not it will jump to the label starting with gender restart which is this label here so that will jump back and reset the character creation process. If you are happy, however, it'll say your adventure is about to unfold. Now another final branch to determine the starting location. So again, similar sort of thing to the name. If you're the male Lancer Brown, you will transfer to the Lancer starting area, etc, etc. Ninja will start in Ninja Starts. Uh, Warlock will go to the Warlock start area and the Aliens will go to the Alien Homeworld. You can see all of these places here. They're very basic. As I say, it's just a demo. Um, but I hope you learned something from it. Uh, as I say, the download is available on the RPG Maker forums. It's uploaded via Google Drive and it's about 160 megabytes. Uh, but all of the information is included in that. It's all unencrypted, so you can see how I did everything. You can play about with it. You can you know, pull it over to your own game, you could do anything with it. All I ask is you like, subscribe, um, and that would be fantastic. You'd, you'd, re you'd really support me by doing that. Um, I hope to get more tutorials up soon. If you have any requests, please do let me know. And until then, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope you learn a thing or two from this. Thanks a lot for watching. Cheers. Take care. Bye.